On a holiday when most businesses go dark, a bright neon sign serves as a beacon for bowlers. Yeah, it's been there ever since the bowl's been here. Yeah! Playing at Kent Bowl today doesn't cost a single cent. You can do it! <laughs> I thought that was really nice. I only got um, three. I missed now. It's an offer that sounded good to the Tubbs fan. We bowl and then we go back to the house and have pie. <laughs> Behind the scenes at this family business. It is pretty noisy back here. The free day comes with a backstory. <laughs> the reason why Thanksgiving, a day of gratitude, What's nice shoes? is also a day they're open. That's hard. It's not, um, yeah, I mean, he's my father. And this was his business for over 50 years. Her dad, Jack Zabarak. So he's all known in the bowling industry as Zab. Son Dennis says his father passed away last year. So it was about three weeks before Thanksgiving. Yeah, and I miss him. Here, they remember the man who left a job at Boeing for bowling. He ran this place for more than 50 years. Everybody wants to buy this real estate, whether it's for a fitness center, uh, a hotel, or right up the freeway ramp. But he wants the city to have a bowling center. He's turned them away for decades. Uh, yeah, he was not going to sell. He was not going to sell. Zab had a business plan he was passionate about. Well, he wanted to make sure that this place stays here. Hopefully, when I'm long gone. So I'll do one, two, three, four, and one nine. His employees knew it. His kids knew it. Yeah, it's all about family. It, it, yeah. A family-friendly place is what Zab wanted, and that brings us to today. He wanted every families to come together and bowl, so on Thanksgiving he, he gives free bowling. It was the best way to honor my dad. For Zab, this is what a perfect game looks like. It's the legacy he wanted to leave. In honor of Zab, in the city of Kent, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.